Hello beautiful people, how are you guys doing today? It's me again and welcome back to another vlog. So for today's video, we are here again in the farm, our favorite view to do a vlog, to have time to talk to you all. So for today's video is, we're going to talk about what the things that I don't like here in the province. It's coming up! First one is the mosquito. So maybe in your place, uh, maybe in United States, maybe there is like no lots of mosquito there. But here in the Philippines, uh, in the whole year, January till December, we have a mosquito and they are lots. But you can use like a mosquito repellent to uh, help the mosquito to go away. But if you use it for a two, uh, one week straight the mosquito can deal with it and they just not go and they can stay even you use it so it's also things that i don't like here because the mosquito is really a uh, bad one you can't stay outside at night like to relax or something outside you can't do that because the mosquito is really lots here if you do like that your hands you will touch them that's sure you will see if you are in the province you will see lots of mosquito but there is like a kind of house here uh, mostly the wood house the mosquito can easily go there uh, mostly the people do like electric fan to go, to make the mosquito fly away and but me i don't like the electric fan or aircon it's make me feel uh dizzy uh what I use here at night is when we sleep, we use a net. Uh, it's a look like a tent net that we put uh, in our bed. That's we are using to sleep here. So that's the first one. I don't like here in the province because of that mosquito. So the second is the transportation that to go in town. So uh, plus our road here is really bad and you can be scared to yeah especially me i was scary so i don't feel like to go in town lots and so let's go to the topic so the second is the transportation to go in town so we have here like we pay some uh, drivers of motorcycle here uh to bring us to the town so Lately, the gasoline is really expensive and most of the driver are stopped to do uh, that their job. So we have like struggle to find, and even before, you need to wait long. If you are, uh, watch my old video before that I go in town. So that one, we it takes long to wait a motorcycle in the road. So uh, it's almost like two hours you wait there for two hours and that really too long i don't like that one too and it's only better better here if you have your own uh, motorcycle so you can go <coughs> in the town anytime you want so here if you are pay someone to uh, bring you in town you just need to stand in the road and waiting for the motorcycle drivers to come arrive and you can get a ride but around <clears throat> around nine in the morning they are all gone like you need to be like really early so that's really things that i also don't like here because yeah the road also is scary hope they fix the road really and let's proceed to the third one so the third one is the water here so you are watch my last video 
uh, that I talk about the water so we don't have like a really good su supply of water here like the other uh, place have like they have a good supply of the water from the city here in the province that we're uh, some of the place here have but here where I am right now is we don't have those kind and <clears throat> uh, all the people here they build <clears throat> they build a water uh, well that's how we work in here and we have a water here from government but it's for the farmers that to support a water here that I show you in the last in the other video too if you guys all remember so that's water it's uh, you can't use it for cooking right so what we do here is we catch the rain so it's good when it's rain you don't have problem to uh, water you have enough supply of water but if uh, sunny you will be struggle to have your water to drink to cook uh, to shower because everything is dry when it's like a one month straight to be sunny everything is dry here the so well the ground will be cracked because it's a really dry place here I don't know that is really not good thing too so some people here like uh, they living in a little bit good life not really rich just a little bit so they can create like a water pump so they have a water that is already filtered you now the water is look clean and not look brown like the water will have so the water pump is uh, maybe a good one to have here but not everyone have those kind so mostly it's easy to have a water well because it's free to do so one day i hope to build a water pump for the farm milly maybe one day so all right guys that's all for today's video i hope you do enjoy this one if you do give me a thumbs up and don't forget to leave a comment down below i really appreciate a lot so uh i still not going town yet the optical clinic is not called me yet so if they are call me i was bring you to the town again and we do a vlog again as always guys so i will love to show you what's going on then and i can't wait to try on the uh, eyeglasses so we will see so hope you're all doing great today and thank you so much again for supporting my channel please don't forget to subscribe and if you already do it thank you and always remember to take care stay safe i will see you next time Word for a day, moon, in Tagalog, Buwan, in Bisaya, Bula. Thank you so much, guys. <laughs> it's so close to the camera. They eat a rice. The big one, they are joined, but they are like to fight the little chick. But they are not be close to the people. If we are getting close to them, they will go and not eat. Now they're far. The big one is far. If we put our hands there, they will believe. They are scared. You look sick. This one is a boy also. You're a boy, right? This block is also this getting close. Black one. It looks like a wak wak. It's a wak. It's 
the seeds they ate. It's a uh, rice seeds. 